first student group on campus that brings together scholars, activists, and students to raise awareness of the injustice, injustices taking place in the Middle East, educate the campus, and discuss possible solutions. We're very lucky to have with us tonight Professor Andy Dabashi, Chair of the European Studies Program at Columbia University. But it goes without saying that this event really would not have been possible without the effort and the support of a few Iranian graduate students here at Stanford, most notably Shadow and Thank you, Rosa. Thank you. Thank you, Roxana, and thank you all for joining us tonight for this very special occasion. As many of you know, we are getting close to the one-year anniversary of the questionable Iranian presidential election, which gave rise to the birth of an unprecedented non-violent civil rights movement in the Middle East, namely the Iranian Green Movement. On this occasion, we are honored to be hosting Professor Dabashi, who is a world-renowned cultural critique as well as an award-winning author of multiple books which have been translated in many languages. I would refer you all to look at his website to learn more about his scholarly contributions over the last 30 years. But tonight, we have invited him to speak to us mainly because of his activism in the media. Not only does he appear regularly on CNN, BBC, and Al Jazeera, but he also has a weekly program on the internet called The Weekly Me by Kami Dabashi. This program is unique in its kind, where each episode is anchored by an analytical interview offering insights into various aspects of the movement with one or more prominent guests. Many of us follow this program on the program every week religiously on Facebook and share it with our friends here and inside you. As a prelude to the talk, I would like to share with you part of an episode, which is my personal favorite. This, uh, in this episode, Dr. Dabashi interviews Professor Cornel West of Princeton University about what lessons the Green Movement activists, like many of you here, can learn from the American civil rights movement. I hope you also enjoy it. As they go. Now, what does that mean? That means then that when you look at Iranian society, you want to look at it through the lens of poor and working because there's class struggles going on in every society. But if we're actually going to embrace everyone, and we're going to put a good chapter back, which is the least of these essentially, the prisoners, the orphans, the widows, the fathers, the money, the oppressed, the poor, the working people, then your social analysis comes in and says, well, let's look at how it leads to action. Thank you. 
نمی آورد جنبش سبز اعادی این فرهنگ جهانگرد است این فرهنگ نه انسان اسلامی است و نه ضد اسلامی نه سکولار است نه ضد سکولار متدگیر و سکولار را در خود حرض می کند و به سوی شناخت بردری از خودمان سوق می دهد برگزاری روز جهانی کارگر در ایران یادآور حضور فرهنگ سیاسی ملت ما در ابعاد فرامیده است